You know, stocks have been on a tear since Election Day, haven't they? They've gone up over 900 points. Right now, they're up about 920 points, about 5%. Yes, it is a Trump rally, up 14 right now on the Dow. The price of oil sitting around $50 per barrel. Let's check the big tech stocks. And there's a reason why we're doing this, because Donald Trump is, uh, has invited the tech heavyweights to a meeting one week from now in New York City. Most of them are up, but not by much, and they have not recovered after their losses following the election. Capital, uh, who's with us here? Oh, it's the man himself. It is Shah Galani. He's sitting right next to me. Capital wave strategist Shah Galani. All right. You may have heard my editorial there, The Art of the Deal, yes. Top of the Hour. I say that negotiation, that's all, that's what he does. Artistically said, I he does it well. I also say he's got a strong arm, Silicon Valley. What say you? He may have a hard time doing that. I mean, they were against him, and most of them are Hillary fans and voted for Hillary. So it's, I think this is fantastic. He's reaching out to them. I'm, I want to see who comes and attends this and what happens. But I think what I like about this is he's reaching out, and he's not addressing a particular company. He's now addressing an entire industry, the tech industry. And I think that's very that's positive for the industry. It's positive for jobs in America. It's positive for bringing jobs back here. The writing's on the wall, isn't it? I mean, hey. Come on, guys. It's been on the wall. It's been on the wall since his campaign trail, and now he's he's a man of action. He's already taken action. He's already got results. So he's, this got, is, he's got leverage. He's got a great they, bully pulpit. He's got the ultimate bully pulpit, and he's bringing people together and creating action, actionable terms and conditions and possibilities, and the market loves it. You're a little soft about this. I think he's going to strong arm Silicon Valley. He's going to say, hey, you want visas for qualified people to work in Silicon Valley? Well, bring your hundreds of billions of dollars back to America. Get on with it. I would like him to do that. I think that would be very powerful and helpful, but I don't know that he will. I don't know if he has that power yet. Perhaps when he's actually in the office, he may then have that kind of persuasion. <laughs> oh, he'll have that kind of persuasion. I, I hope sure. so. I think he will. I approve. I like to see him lay the law down. All right, that's me.